There's antimony, arsenic, aluminum, selenium, and hydrogen, and oxygen, and nitrogen, and uranium, and nickel, neodymium, neptunium, germanium, germanium, and iron, and americium, ruthenium, uranium, uranium, zirconium, latesium, and adium, and lanthanum, and osmium, and acetine, and radium, and gold, and actinium, and indium, and gallium, and iodine, and thorium, and thulium, and thallium. There's yttrium, terbium, actinium, rubidium, and more gadolinium. Silicon and silver and samarium and bismuth, chromium, lithium, beryllium, and thallium. Second verse. There's homium and helium and hapium and erbium and phosphorus and francine and fluorine and terbium and manganese and mercury, polonium and magnesium, dysmorphium and scandium and cerium and cesium. There's lead, rutherium, nimium and platinum, plutonium, palladium, rubidium, potassium, polonium, and tantalum, potassium, titanium, tellurium, and cadmium, calcium, and chromium, and curium, and silver, californium, and fermium, and helium, and also magnesium, einsteinium, nobelium, and carbon, krypton, neon, radon, zinc. Rhodium and chlorine, carbon, cobalt, copper, tungsten, and sodium. These are the only ones for which the news has come to Harvard. There may be many others, but they haven't.